A late night news bulletin now on BBC One with Maxine Mawinney. And there'll be full coverage of the funeral of Diana, Princess of Wales, starting at 6 a.m. on BBC One. But that's all from the newsroom tonight. Good night. Hello, we're going to see some rain push its way southwards over the country in the next 24 hours, but amounts in the south will be very small indeed. Overnight tonight, temperatures inland could be as low as 6 or 7 degrees, but showers are going to continue in those northwestern areas, and later it'll turn rather more cloudy, but uh, for southern and eastern areas it should be a clear night for the rest of the night to come. Now, we've seen some cloud across uh, southern areas, but that's uh, moved away, and we're now looking up to the northwest for our next weather system. That's going to push rain southeast across the country during the next 24 hours. We pick it up at approaching northwestern parts of Scotland on Saturday morning and then it moves uh, southeast right throughout the day across Scotland, Northern Ireland by the middle of the day and then on into northern parts of England during the afternoon. I think it'll be late in the afternoon before it gets the uh, far south of the Midlands and just a few spots there and southeast England should stay dry right through until the early evening. Temperatures then highest in the southeast, 20, 21 degrees, but about 16 to 18 in the north and that westerly wind will certainly freshen, becoming quite strong. Now there's the weather system producing that uh, rain, pushing its way southwards. A front straggling the country on Sunday, so after a cloudy start, many areas, particularly in the southeast, will brighten up. That's it from me. Good night. Now, just before BBC One closes down for the night, we spend a moment in quiet reflection with Mother Teresa, who died earlier today. There'll be a celebration of the life and work of Mother Teresa in a special Everyman programme being shown this Sunday night at 10.45 here on BBC One, with another chance to see it on Monday morning at 9 o'clock on BBC Two. Well, now, just before we close, a reminder that BBC One will be on the air from 6am this morning as people gather in London for the funeral of Diana, Princess of Wales. Then, from 8.30, David Dimbleby introduces Diana, the nation's farewell. And so, with the time at 7 minutes to 2, we come to the end of BBC One's programmes for Friday. On the eve of a sombre day for the nation, from all of us here, we'd like to wish you a peaceful good night. Good night.